Hello everybody and welcome back to the Outer Worlds. In the last part, we found Harem, and he needs communications back up. So we gotta convince these guys to like lower their broadcast or something. Hey. Well, new business turns up at last. Celia, didn't I tell you our new statistics-based advertising model would be a hit? That you did, sir. How can yield improvements of 26.7% not pink not pink green hair? How can 32% cost savings not moisten the loins? Oh, it does to me. You've often posed these very questions. Clear my schedule. This newcomer has a meeting with me. Doesn't sound like he really has a schedule. You have a meeting with me. Did you hear that power play, Celia? They don't make them like this anymore in Halcyon. I only hope you don't judge me by my handshake. Now, what business brings you here? If you want to judge me, I'll grab you by the dick. <laughs> uh, I'm charting my own path, going where the wind takes me. What a charming notion. One doesn't meet many free spirits in Halcyon. Not outside Tartarus prison, anyway. Forgive me, I'd be positively enraptured. Only, I take it this means you aren't here for sell tuna. You're selling tuna? If I have to eat one more weird science project passed off as food in this sprat fucked colony, I'm going to stab someone. <laughs> yes. Yes, that's it. Channel your anger. This guy is into I it. I wish I could do the same. <laughs> Seems like you're having a rough time, Mr. Sanjar. Are you doing quite all right? Oh, don't worry on my account. This is merely the latest in a long line of professional erotic and athletic disappointments. I had hoped that livening up our advertisements with enticing figures would draw the other corporations back to our bosom, but it seems we're back to the drawing board. Not too bad for you. Sounds like a personal problem. I've got other concerns. What can I, do for you? I met Grim. Oh yeah, Grim. Let's give him a recommendation. I see. And was his delivery of the MSI authorized greeting up to snuff? Can I say no? That guy's a world-class moron. Nah, he's a good guy. Well, that's excellent. I'll see that your feedback makes it into his review. What else can I do? Four out of five stars. One, because he didn't suck me off. Um, You're jamming Devil's Peak. You think we're the problem? Have you even heard the nonsense Graham is spewing? I don't even know who Graham is. It isn't easy keeping a town like Stellar Bay afloat, especially without the board's backing. We need that frequency to reach our trading partners. I'll deal with Graham. Right now I'm talking to you. My, you know how to take control of a situation, don't you? This guy's getting it's a little weird. Here. Is anyone else warm? Is he horny what for he me? to say is that we'll happily oblige. But first, we need your help with the plan to get MSI restored to the board. <laughs> Not as badly as you need me to control my itchy f trigger finger lady. Wait, is that sexual? Or does that mean I'm going to kill them? I'll just say this, just to play it safe. It's a two-pronged approach. The first part involves seeing Stellar Bay properly defended. How long did it take you that to figure out you need to defend the city? Not long, but the devil is always in the details. And the salient detail here is a Bolt 52 cartridge. If you can get us what we need to rejoin the board, starting with the Bolt 52, we won't need to advertise anymore. We can stop our transmissions altogether. And you'll have a powerful ally on the board. What is it? Is that a gun or ammo? Why, one of the strongest defenses in Halcyon. An extremely powerful ordinance. Alright, what's the other part of your plan? I'll need to gather some supplemental materials, but I mustn't get ahead of myself. You do tend to do that. The Bolt 52 will be in the old arms building southwest of town, which used to be part of Stellar Bay before we had to move our walls in. And these days, it's overrun with marauders and raptodons. I'm not perceptive enough. I guess I'll go get your bolt. Do be careful. I've lost more than a few people to marauders and raptodons out there. Oh, and while you're at it, 
There should be a terminal in the arms building with some dangerous information. Perhaps you could delete it so it doesn't fall into the wrong hands. Oh, of course. I could probably sell it. Sure, bye. Okay. Uh, this is not the exit door. Okay. So it's south. Where? Where is this other guy? Graham? Is that his name? Alright, I'm gonna go talk to him. Just in case these two quests or like two things I need to do for them cross each other. So that way I can do them both at once. Let's just back away. Back it up. Back away. We're good. We're all good. No one's gonna harm anyone. Okay, run. What is this? Are you safe? Ah, uh, nope, it ain't. Oh, it's like ass. Don't know why I didn't think of that. It's green. Oh, what? Did I kill these guys? I don't remember if I came this way. I'm just gonna go around them. I've done enough killing for one lifetime. Or just one day. I will kill again. You can count on it. I wonder if I send in my party to, like, in front of hostiles, if they'll, like, attack. Oh, is this a Kajik camp? If you don't get that reference, you never played Skyrim. Also, how does this not count as stealing? Is this technically... Do these people live here or something? Alright, let's go in. Well, hello, and welcome to the home of the Iconoclast. I'm Rose. Please take a pamphlet. Make sure you print enough. In it, you'll find everything you need to know about Graham, his philosophers, truths, and the iconoclast way. He wrote it himself, you know. Oh, oh no! I'm so sorry. I keep forgetting. We're out of pamphlets. Gosh, blast it! You don't know. If you don't have enough pamphlets, that can cost you greatly. I once heard a story of a great, heroic warrior. Didn't have enough pamphlets, got thrown in jail. But then he broke out and the revolution began. Uh, you're offering me a pamphlet you don't have. I don't really want one. That paper they use makes excellent kindling, you know. If they ever get more, you ought to grab some. What? Nioka? That's why you wanted so many? You said you were just spreading the word. So you're While spreading you the flame. Your company, you're welcome all the same. We're the only free people in Halcyon. No corporations, no shackles, no problems. What about Reptonons or Marauders? Oh, those are just hurdles. We deal with them as they come. You can't really jump You're over them. To stay with us, so long as you can earn your keep. Uh, I'm here to talk to someone about your broadcasts. Oh, you've heard Graham's teachings. I'm so glad. He and Zora have done such a wonderful job spreading the light around this dark, dark planet. You can think of those two as our leaders, but they're more like examples. We all ought to be more like them. So what is this cult called? We're going to find him. Graham's place is in the large building straight back. Zora's sometimes there talking with him, but usually she's in the triage clinic next door. Okay, bye. I ought to mention, the Iconoclasts are loyal folk. Treat them right, they'll do the same. Turn on them, they'll open fire without a second thought. Good to know. Everybody here looks wore out. Is it just me? Ah, yeah, they seem fine. It ain't right. How many good folk are we gonna lose to our missions? That's just the way of it. We gotta earn our keep out here. That don't mean we ought to be following her into the jaws of a manta queen. You'd rather sit on your thumbs and starve? No. All I'm saying is she gotta be more careful throwing away lives like that. Hi. Are you Batman? Your lower jaw is un unveiled. Hey, stop pointing that thing at me. Speak like Batman. Oh, Graham. A manta queen. Turn yeah. your shit off. We felled it, mind. But we lost two runners and five gun hands. Oh, no. A total failure, then. So much for the ruins. And hell only knows where the Van Noys are. They never showed. I'm sure they're... Ah, let's talk later. It seems we have company. Did you just notice me? Hi. 
A stranger nice comes mutton to chops. If you're looking for a path to walk, you've found one. If you're looking for a teacher, I am one. Welcome to the Iconoclasts. Why does every, like, cult leader wear a scarf like that? Everyone that's trying to, like, show the light, reveal the teachings, yada, 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 that bullshit. Why do they always have a scarf? Why is that a thing? I've told you I have pamphlets. That's a sham. Uh, stop using Devil's Peak. Stop? No. Spreading the truth is the only way to combat the board's poisonous campaign of propaganda against their people. Your broadcasts aren't working. No one's listening. I realize the board has blockaded our efforts, but Devil's Peak is an interplanetary radio tower. Surely somebody is listening. You probably are. Surely. To yourself. It's not that it's not getting out. It's that the people who hear it don't care. Uh, excuse me. I'm from Edgewater on Terra 2. If you'll pardon my saying, nobody I know has ever heard of you. All the more reason to double down on our efforts. No. Graham, we should be focusing on survival anyway. Food, ammo, and medicine. Maybe now is the time to pivot. Pivot, huh? If radio isn't working, we might try another way. Print more it pamphlets. The captain's timing is more than just serendipitous. It must be fate. I've had my sights on an old printing press for some time. Oh my god, was I right? The board uses magazines and advertisements to subtly focus the colony's attention. We will use their tricks against them. Wait, that's not what I meant. Help me clear out and repair the press, and I will have no need for that rust bucket of a radio tower. That's too much work. I'll just kill you now and be done with it. Oh, God. Uh, okay, sounds fair. Wonderful. I requisitioned replacement rollers for it some time ago. Huxley should have delivered them yesterday. Speaking of which, where is Huxley? You bought rollers? You haven't even cleared the wraps out yet. What are you doing wasting bits on... Wait, where is Huxley? It seems we're out a runner. If you intend to help our cause, I'll ask you to meet our MSI supplier in her stead. How much shit am I doing for you? Okay. Wonderful. While you're at it, I wonder if Carlotta still has those high-capacity cartridges. Grab a few, will you? There should be some funds left over from the last shipment. We can use them to copy and modify radio serials. Yes, not just magazines, but their precious dramas. Unbelievable. I hope I don't have to tell you this, but if there is extra money, would you mind buying, I don't know, food and medicine? Graham. If you need me, I'll be in triage. Okay. Get the printing press rollers. Get high capacity cartridges or extra supplies. What? Okay. She's over there. I thought she was like somewhere around here. So now where is this in the map? Oh. That's over there. And where was the bolt? Hmm, pretty far. Okay, let's go for the bolt first, because it seems more fun that way. Or maybe if I get it, I can use the bolt to clear out whatever else. The rolling press place. Cannot go that way. But I swear, if this bolt... He said it's a, what is it, like an ordinance device? Only place on the planet if it's a feather, I'm going to be furious. Can you reckon a smell or something like a feather. Maybe the wind helps. Hi. Good job, everyone. Level 12. As I said in the last part, I re wait, no, that's not, this is my dialogue. I was looking at this like my dialogue. I want to get my dialogue very high so I can just skip past most conversations. Booyah. And I got a perk. Uh, where are these? 
Okay, let's get the 50% off consumables. So I have 105 now. 86, goddamn. That was like 20 pounds. Feels like the old bits outside of Edgewater. I don't know why I keep crouching. Uh, oh, you're a big one. Oh, there's another one. Where'd you come from? It's like, where'd that big one go? Here they come. There we go. Come on, reel up. Oh, you're a tough one. Oh, there's a lot of them here. Okay. 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 Oh, this is gonna be fun. Ah! Oh, I am the Reaper of Death. Hey, you guys, good. He just rises up out of his gut. Oh, where'd your head go, dude? Open. Great barricade. Almost gonna get past it. Uh, hello, hello. I hear boots out there. Wait, can I? Am I wearing boots? boots? <laughs> Snarl like a rhapsody on. Hello, who's in there? I don't think we figured that out yet. Who are you? Oh, thank the Eternal. I'm Huxley. Oh, Hux. Hux, if you're lazy. I'm stuck. My friends and I were scavenging here, and a Mad Queen showed up, then wrapped it on. Oh, is there going to be another one of those? I ran in here, and um, now the door's locked. Little help? Well, I need to get in that room. <laughs> Maybe I'll let you starve first. Phew. Thanks, mister. My buddy had a key, but I ain't heard him in a while. He locked me in here and took off. Probably got munched. Yeah, he got decapitated. I'll look for a dead guy, I guess. Or a rat. Maybe it's in a rat belly. Gross. Yeah, I found it. Getting all stuffy in there, and I was getting a mite lightheaded, and I think maybe I was gonna die. Now I'm out here, and I'm headed back to Amber Heights. Still landing yourself in trouble, eh, Hux? Oh, hi, Mioka. Um, you mind giving me an escort back home? I'm. Oh, you're traveling with someone. Never mind. Yep. Bye bye. <laughs> I can attack her. Why can you attack everybody in this game? With the trouble you caused me, you're dying here. She didn't cause me any trouble. Normally, when you help someone, they give you something for their trouble. But I ain't got nothing on me. How's about a heaping helping of appreciation and respect? Oh, you mean a blowjob. <laughs> Being saved by me, you entered a non-negotiable contract. You now owe recompense. Give me something or I'm stuffing you back in there. I can't buy ammo with the appreciation and respect. Yeah, I'll persuade. Uh, that's true. Okay, fine. Here. All right. Good luck. Thanks a lot, Mister. Is the gun in here? The bolt. Oh. Oh wait, it wasn't an actual gun. It was uh. It was just like a cartridge. Okay. I guess I might as well try and wipe any terminals. Oh, a ring. How much is that worth? Let me guess. I can't wear it. How are you going to get past this? What are you going to... Oh. Huh. Okay, you jumped. Ah. Oh, here we go. Wait, what did I just do? Too many words. Oh, wait. This is like the bad shit. 
Okay, so he's an idiot. Shows consistent disregard for prescribed fonts and formats. Some of his work has been flagged or subversive undertones. Okay. And Dora. Alright. Because I'll delete them all. So they were just like reviews for all those people. Yeah, let's just go give it back to him. Hello. Well, I see you've had a sobering effect on our friend Nioka. Sir, please stop. Forgive me, Celia. I couldn't help myself. Anyway, what can I do for you? I got your thing. Hey, I found a review. You weren't supposed to look. I asked you to delete it. You didn't say I couldn't look. Yes, but then you would have known. This has been my albatross. The great shame of my career. I give MSI everything. My work, my youth, my left kidney, and for years, I was a joke to them. Your left kidney? Ugh, one of the executives required a transplant. They couldn't find I anybody else. To donate might oh. improve my prospects. Did it? Apparently not. Uh, who cares what they think? You're in charge now, right? In charge of a scrap heap of a city. Abandoned by the board and surviving only through the hypocrisy of our trading partners. And you made it work. That's more than anyone can say for those execs. You put it that way, it does sound pretty pathetic. Please, I, I can't think about this right now. Celia, schedule 30 minutes of inconsolable weeping later today. I'll pad it out with an extra 15, sir. Now, was there something else you need? Can I join you? Uh, here's a bolt. Oh, yes. I'm going to be up all night with this. All those blanks waiting to be filled, boxes waiting to be ticked. Try to control yourself, sir. Have you any idea how powerful this is? Corporations have been toppled Ooh. with less. You made it sound like you were sending me after a weapon. But that's, that's what I thought. That's exactly what this is. The world isn't changed with guns and speeches. It like could be. Graham and his followers would like to think but rather with meticulous documentation. And the bill of liquidation slash transfer form 52 is one of the most formidable pieces of data entry in all of Halcyon. One false stroke can invalidate the entire document. It's true. One of the old execs gave herself a stroke trying to fill out the exemption section. Hmm. Uh, don't hurt yourself, I guess. Your concern is most touching, but not to worry. I've been preparing years for this. For our part, a bill of liquidation slash transfer form 52 will protect Just say our the holdings bolt. on Monarch by temporarily assigning them to a pass-through entity once we drop our bomb on the board. Let me guess. A paperweight? See, that doesn't even make sense. This is an electronic form. We don't need paperweights. You can use it as a paperweight. Hardly the point, sir. Just tell me what you're planning. I have reason to believe that one of the other corporations is operating on Monarch. Illegally and in secret. Those bastards. Leave us to our perils, then come back just to reap what they can. If we can find proof, I can use that as leverage to encourage certain powers that be to accept our Bolt 52 and reinstate us on the board. What does that mean for me? If someone is operating here, then Catherine's almost certainly supplying them out of Fallbrook. Perhaps she could be convinced to tell you where they are. Sounds like you know her well enough. That's Yourself? part of the problem. She has certain ambitions for Stellar Bay. And I fear my asking her would give her the leverage she's been looking for. Don't get yourself worked up, sir. It's perfectly natural to have a healthy fear of her. Oh, she's not fun scary like you. Just scary scary. I'm but fun that's scary? But will be equipped to handle her. But I'm fun. I'm not scary scary. So, go to Fallbrook and get the location of an illegal corporate facility, then... Once you, uh, subtly work out where this corporate facility might be, bring back proof of its operation. Maybe some nice letterhead. Or someone working there. That would do it. Infiltrate a secret corporate base and kidnap the staff. Sure. Easy. A foolproof plan if I ever heard one. I'll leave the execution to you. Oh wait, is he talking about Hiram? Like, is that who he's looking for? 
Uh, I'll just go. Yeah, I'll do the Hiram stuff and then maybe I'll come back for you. Oh wait, I have to do this mission anyway. Do I? Oh wait, he didn't stop transmitting, did he? God damn it. Alright, fine, let's go do this then. Finish up. What's your name? Sanjar. Uh, where is she at? Oh, I was here already. I didn't go in, that's right. Was this a place where... Nioka said to, like, get drinks or something? We can get some drinks while we're here. What do you think of the unreliable Parvati? There's always something to fix. And it's neat working in the Aether. I always took Atmo for granted. Now, if I drill through the hole, we all suffocate. Exciting, you know? I... I'm not sure I wanted to know that. Being in space sets me on edge enough. You know about stellar emissions? A actually, I probably shouldn't tell you about those. I mean, not unless you want to know how we're all likely to get spacers long. Right. Okay. When we get back to the ship, I'm drinking this conversation right out of my recollection. I'll join you. Holy crap, magazine costs two bits? Would that be two dollars? What's the equivalent of bits to cash? Hi. Time for a round of whisk. Or a round of whiskey. Or both. I, I don't like the way folks are looking at me, Captain. Like I'm a sandwich. Maybe I could stand a little closer to you. Uh, you're pretty far. Hi, guys. I'm here to... T Hi, Catherine. Hi. Uh-huh. You blind fella? Or can you not see I'm busy? Both. Why is it every sisty pig fucker who strolls into my town expects me to smile and shout awful friendly? Welcome to Fallbrook. I see what Only he means by scary scary. She's got some scars. Land, like a void damn advert. Catherine, you're Was as she drinking? welcoming as ever. Truthfully spoken, I do aim to properly represent my aforementioned nugget of paradise. Ooh, I could charm her. If by nugget of paradise you mean piece of manty dung, then sure. You know, I ain't heard that one before. Suppose I'll have to work harder to show you just what makes our town shine. But first, I'll need to know what brings you, stranger. Well, I'm half listening. I appreciate it. Uh, Sanji. S -s -s I don't know why I said Sanji. Sanjar said you know something about corporate operation... And secret a monarch. Might be I know something about it. Might be someone hired my crew to blind drop supplies on the northern bridge. Might be they sure as shit weren't pirates. They keep saying the word now might be I a lot. It, I ain't heard from my delivery team in far too long. Find them for me, and I'll pay you handsomely. Oh, sure. Have me be everyone's errand boy. Okay. And I'll thank you kindly. Okay, goodbye. Have I been up to that area? Oh, north of here. What would be tra what would be faster? Uh looks like this. Oh. What is that sound? Oh crap. Oh man, mantisaurus. And we're stalking. Hopefully there's no manta queen. Okay, it's over there. We could deal with these bozos. Why is that empty? There we go. Oh boy. Let's go in with this. Come on. Uh, yeah. okay? Great. Thank God the queen's over there. What is that? What is that? Why is it doing that? Is that supposed to be smoke? Or like a shield? I don't know. Let's go find that guy. Oh boy. 
Is there fall damage? Yep, doesn't matter. Oh, come on. Apparently it does matter. Ah, oh, boy. Come here, you. Oh, there's another. Okay, they're dead. Again. Should I wait to get my health back? I bounced down this like crazy. Is there another way down besides going all the way over there? Okay, come on. Oof. So I'm good. Don't worry. What? Oh. Your legs have been damaged too many times, and your movement speed has now been apparently lowered. Uh, so I can accept this, but I get a perk. No. Oh, I thought that was gonna kill me. What happened here? We ought uh, to talk about this. Yeah. The trail of blood leads away from the auto loader. Oh, I have to follow it. Yep. All right, let me move here quick. Oh, earrings. I bet I can't wear those either. Okay, let's follow the bread blood trail. Oh, that was fast. Smuggler tunnel. Are these marauders or are these... Those gonna, well, I guess they would be marauders because they're smart enough to go in a tunnel. They've got booby traps. Can you shoot these? Okay. Can you jump over this? Careful, guys. Okay. Oh. How'd you turn it off? What did I kill? Oh! Oh, I backed into it, didn't I? Oh god, oh god. Heal! No worry, I'm fine. It'll go away, probably. Oh, they're on the wall. Tricky. Oh, I killed a sprat. Oh, I'm so sorry. Protective clothing with safety harness gold. Nah, I'll stick with this. Okay, okay. Big jump time. Big jump time. Big jump! Nailed it. How do you guys get past it? Oh! Mm. Huh? Oh, survivor. Wait, did he set these traps up? Oh, they're different colors because they do different damage types. Got it. Hello. Stay back. I may be wounded, but I'm still armed. How'd you get past my traps anyway? A lot of traps. I've got moves. Just remember, I still got bullets. In case you get any funny ideas. Oh, me too. And I got back. What are you up. doing out here anyway? Uh, oh, I'm a, I'm a doc. That feels a mite better. Wish I had something to give you, but I not through my last sprat worst an hour ago. No, oh, don't worry. I just killed a couple more. Uh, Catherine told me some of her couriers have gone missing out here. Nice to know she cares. Catherine had us making drops for some big shot client out here. And before you ask, I don't know who they are. Or were. The whole point of making drops in the middle of nowhere was to keep their identity and whereabouts a secret. Get to the point where you're hiding in a cave. Marauders were waiting for us. They blew the bridge and took off with the shipment. Where'd they go? Last I saw, they were heading back up the hill. You'll see it on the right when you get out of here. If you've got the sand to go after them, 
I'm sure Catherine can reward you for your trouble. But do I have Me? to? Me? I'm headed back to Fallbrook, just as soon as I've caught my breath. Alright, you're welcome for healing you. Oh, there's another scythe. Mr. Power. Plasma damage. Ooh. Ali Ali taxi free. <laughs> Fuck, what is that a reference to? Is that a reference to something? Alright, I think I found everything. Let's get out of here without blowing up. Preferably. Alright, what is this? Will that turn these off? Who knows? Doesn't matter. Okay, how far are they? Ugh. Oh, damn it. Okay, we'll do that in the next part, because I was thinking about maybe I should go there. But it's been a long time, and they're pretty far. It'll probably take a while. So thank you all for watching. Be sure to ever down below, leave a like, subscribe, share, and I'll see you all in the next part. Goodbye.